HP might not be the first brand that comes to your mind when it comes to gaming notebooks. But the company has been offering some premium notebooks under the Omen range as well as entry-level and mid-tier notebooks under the Pavilion range. The new Pavilion range has come to India which comes with the new Intel 9th gen processors, updated 1600 Nvidia graphics as well as some cosmetic changes. The new HP Pavilion 15 looks identical to the previous version. Now that's because the new model is essentially using the same design language. It doesn't entirely stand out as a gaming machine and continues to take a minimalistic approach. This makes it great for someone who wants a notebook that can blend in as an everyday laptop and doesn't stand out when using it say in college or an office environment. And when you go back home, you can catch up on winning more of those chicken dinners. The plastic build does make it a bit flimsy in certain places and the matte black rubberized finish can attract fingerprints and smudges. The laptop is fairly slim though and not as heavy as most gaming notebooks out there. The trapezoidal pattern speaker grille makes a comeback as well as the matching violet colored HP logo and keyboard backlighting which does look cool but those are the only gamer focused features that you are going to see on this machine. You do however get a 144Hz 1080p panel. It is an IPS anti-glare micro-edge matte WLED backlit bezel-less display. Of course, it is an edge-to-edge -edge and there is enough space on the top to stuff in a webcam. Notably, the bottom is more angular than before, but all in all, the panel itself looks and feels the same as the previous model. It's a pretty decent display and while you can't compare it with high-end OLED panels, it gets the job done. It is fairly bright and produces good colors as well. But I just want it to be a bit more punchy when it comes to contrast and the overall brightness. As mentioned earlier, HP is now offering the 9th generation Intel processor options on the Pavilion Gaming 15. You can opt for either a Core i5 or Core i7 along with the latest Nvidia GTX 1600 series GPUs with Max-Q design. HP centers the top of the line variant which features an Intel Core i7-9750H 6 core processor with 12GB of DDR4 RAM and a GTX 1660 Ti. As a storage, you get 512GB NVMe M.2 SSD with a 7200RPM 1TB hard drive. Windows boots up fast and everyday tasks like checking mails, browsing through multiple Chrome tabs, streaming videos, all of that is a piece of cake. Of course, you can do a fair amount of gaming and the new GTX 1660 Ti works great. It's a more improved version of the GTX 1060, so you can easily swift through eSport titles. And AAA titles aren't too sharpy as well. I could easily get around 90 FPS on Apex Legends at Ultra settings and about 65 FPS on Rise of Tomb Raider at the highest settings. Now coming to the keyboard, it does feel a little cramped and HP should have used full-size arrow keys considering this is a gaming laptop. You do however get a full-size numpad and while the key travel is a bit shallow, it is pretty good for typing or casual gaming. The notebook comes with a decent set of ports including HDMI, a standard USB port, an Ethernet port, a USB Type-C with no Thunderbolt sadly and an SD card slot. On the other side you get the charging plug, two more USB ports and a 3.5mm audio jack combo. Now for a mid-range gaming notebook, the battery life isn't all that bad. Regular web surfing on Wi-Fi can get you about 5 hours of runtime. Under heavy loads, the battery manages to last about 1 hour and 20 minutes. So basically, if you're looking for a very powerful laptop that can actually blend at work or at play, the new HP Pavilion Gaming 15 is a sweet deal. It isn't as flashy as most gaming notebooks, but you get enough power for your casual gaming needs as well as everyday tasks.